imagine sewage powering your house. Every year, our sewage treatment plants produce huge amounts of sludge. Around a third of the sludge can be made into biogas, which can then be used as an energy source. But most of the sludge has to be shipped off and burned. But what if we could recycle a larger amount of this waste product? TUDELF researcher Steve de Falk is trying to achieve this with some wonderful worms. These worms are able to transform a part of the unused portion of the sludge into usable biomass. In this way, more energy can be obtained from the sludge and less waste product has to be transported and incinerated. We should do something with our waste because we're basically throwing away 30% of potential energy in some form by just burning it. And my worms, they fit in before biogas production. There's your sludge, this sludge you feed to your worms, the worms eat 30% and the leftover sludge you put in a digester to make biogas. And the millions of tons per year, that's a lot of money. A lot of sludge that doesn't have to be transported. How do they eat the sludge? What mechanisms are they using? Are they using enzymes? Are they using, I don't know, acid or base or some weird compo components? Or they chew a lot? I have no idea. So try to figure that out to actually devise a system without worms that do actually the same thing as worms. And um, in this way, reduce the amount of sludge we produce yearly, which means less sludge has to be transported and incinerated. I think this is the biggest part that, that uh, this warm research has brought to society.